We have now drafted the sides, shelves, and top frames of our nightstand, leaving just the top and the toe kick left to draft. So now we are going to draft our top with a length of 16 inches, a width of 13 and 3 quarters inches, and a thickness of 3 quarters of an inch. And you can see it is long enough, the length runs this way, to hang over the sides. And it's wide enough that it hangs over the front and hangs over a drawer face if we build the drawer. So similar to our other steps, we're going to start by selecting the 3D box option. And we are going to enter our length, width, and thickness. So for our first corner, let's enter 0 and enter again. For our length, we're going to pull that off of our heading list here. Our length is 16. Enter. Our width is 13 and 3 quarters, so 13.75. Enter. And we are going to give it a height. The thickness is 0.75. And enter. We have now created our top, similar to other parts, flat on the construction plane of our model. So now the challenge is to put this in the right place. I know that this top is going to overhang the sides by one inch. So make sure your gumball is on. We're going to click on this top we just made, and we're going to single click on this red arrow. And because it is moving this direction, I know I want to move it the other direction. I'm going to type in a negative and one. And this will center the top on our nightstand. Now this is the front of our nightstand, and we want this to overhang the front. So we've got to move this this way. And I know I want it to overhang the front by one past a drawer face on here which will also have a thickness of 0.75. So we're going to select this top and now we're going to click on the green gumball arrow, single click, and we're going to type in a negative 1.75. And this will give us the right overhang along the top. So all we have left to do is move this up to the top of our nightstand we are going to single click on the top, and now we are going to single click the blue gumball area, and we're going to move this up the height of our nightstand, which is 23.25, and enter. And we have now placed the top on our nightstand, and it is flush against the back and overhangs the sides as we click it up. To end, I'm going to come over and I'm going to make a layer. I'm going to call that top, I'm going to give that a color, and I think I will choose purple, say OK, I'm going to select my top, right click on the name of the layer and say change object layer, and I'm going to turn this light bulb off to turn off that top. Realizing that I did not put my top frames on a layer last time, I'm going to hit new layer, I'm going to type in top frames. And I'm going to give that a color. I'm going to give it orange. I'm going to select my top frame. Hold down my shift key to select the other top frame. I'm going to right click on top frames and say change object layer. And I'll turn my top back on. So I now have all of my parts aside from my toe kick. Make sure you come and save your file.